Welcome to X Man. Mega X Man. <laughs> where the My son dude. of Sonic the Hedgehog and Samus Aran Look at that rad travels oh, the world. Whoa, shit. he's doing wheelies, but it's not On a his wheel. sick hover motorcycle. No, X is doing wheelies. Ready? What I send my controls to? Ow. Is there any connection whatsoever between Mega Man and Samus in, like, game development? Ooh, good question. That's a Sean question, maybe. Mega Man and Samus? Well, just because, or at least, like, the Mega Man games and uh, Metroid games, just because... Because they're pretty similar, Mega Man and Samus both are... I mean, you mm. have sweet robot armor. Not really. And they're, then, they're kind of different games. Well, I know, but they both have the hand blaster. It's very, it's very base level connection where but it's what's, like. What's weird is that Mega Man's, his pops out of his his gloves like he has gloves well, if, right yeah, now. Yeah, it's like cyborg, right? Right. The superhero. It it's forms just like out of his arm. Phases into. A, is just. This is just an there. arm cannon. Yeah. But it's similar. Hey. Okay. Whose lore do you like better? Whose oh. lore do I like better? Samus or Mega? Or Mega Man. I think Mega I think Man's Mega is Man. more fun. Yeah. It's... Really. Samus's is cool. I kind of like Samus's lore because of Samus's the, is cool, like the Chozo shit. I love the Chozo shit and yeah. how like they chose her to be like, they Chozo chose her. The Chozo chose her. They think, ch they chose her to be like a god for them or like for me she's. Is, I don't know enough about Metroid. Lore. Oh, look into it, dude. Look at like there's deep dives on mm -hmm. like Samus's like origins and how she came to be, in that morph suit and shit like that, and like she was, cr like almost, rigorously trained into being who she is now. I knew that. She's like, it was worse than like ah. any, um, like what could I relate that to? Like a, uh, The Witcher. Like she, it was kind of like that. Gotcha. Like doing the trial of the grass is kind of crap. Gotcha. I, uh, I think the main reason like where Metroid is more kind of the harder sci-fi, I like Mega Man's like taking sci-fi, but then it also is kind of like a, like a Japanese shonen anime. Yeah, where I was just gonna say that. Yeah, where it's uh, you know, the, your your young male protagonist. What am I fighting for? <laughs> young male protagonist. Yeah, the hero's journey. Mm -hmm. um, Even uh, as moniker X is stands for unlimited potential. Yeah, it's the unknown, unsurmountable. Twenty uh, XX, yeah, dude. Dealing with unsurmountable <laughs> odds, like all that stuff. We only got eighty years left until like this. we're supposed to get Mega Man. What was it Mega Man X? Twenty XXX. 20, 20, 20XX. 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 No, 20XX. Isn't? I thought that was Mega Man. I don't think so. It was Mega Man 20OX. 20OX? Yeah, dude, I have no idea. But I thought, I swore Mega I Man I thought X it was, was 20XX. just always entered 20XX. But it could have been like 1982 shit. I don't know. 1982 <laughs> shit. I think I remember 20XX getting name dropped or some shit in uh, Zero. Mega Man Zero? Yeah, the first one. Okay. Yeah, that could have been. I want to say Mega Man when Zero. When they were doing the back backstory shit. Like twenty one XX or twenty two XX. Yeah, yeah. It took place in the future. It was after I mean, it was hundred years after? Like Mega Man X eight? Yeah. Yes. Top oh, row? Let's go. Top, top row. row. Alright, let's um, do it. What up, 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 up? My history with <laughs> Mega Man Was that a pickle? Is much pickle Rick. Is a Oh, this is fun, boy. Much like my history Rebel with Sponge a, <clears throat> a lot of uh, of uh, Nintendo games, is that I didn't play them because my brother had the Super Nintendo and That's the Nintendo. A secret, by the way, nice. I totally saw. And I uh, oh, frog, don't kill the dude. And I I'm played the, the Genesis the most. It's right? not Wednesday. What are they doing out here? Yeah, Brocho, you played a lot of Genesis. Yeah, and so and then by the time what got was the N64, equivalent of uh, Mega Man on Genesis? I don't know. Was there a game kind of like Mega Man? My closest game so. to a lot of these, well, maybe, I mean, they're not similar games at all, but just color palette and whatever is probably Sonic. Mm-hmm. Right? Yep. Um, but, and then it wasn't until later when I, um, and I, and it was one of those things I always liked the design of, and I watched the cartoons and shit, but I never had any mm -hmm. of the games. Till DS, I got the uh, Zero Collection. Oh, okay. I first borrowed it from Steve. Yeah, you had that on DS. Yep, I borrowed that from him, and then I bought my own. Guys, oh, okay. that's why. And then that's really where my I, I have played like the Nintendo Mega Man's, mm -hmm. 
-hmm. but it was pre <clears throat> I think it was a pre X one because I couldn't uh, wall hang or whatever climb up walls might have okay. been the Mega Man ones then. just Mega Man 8 or yeah, something yeah regular regular Mega Dudes because you, yeah because those ones you couldn't do the wall here's my uh, controversial opinion what I don't think Mega Man X or Mega Man Legends or uh, Mega Man 64 were good games no, I don't either. I played uh, 64. Those, uh, I rented the, that. Like the that dungeon sucked. crawler ones? Yeah. They I were, played them. I didn't like them. They, I rented I it know. once. The controls were wonky. There's so many people that actually adore those games. I know, and I, played I don't know it. why. I played I it for... it's just pure nostalgia. It like, could have been nostalgia. I played it when it came out, and I was like, this game sucks. Yeah. I rented it, played it for like a day or two, uh, and over the course of like maybe a couple hours, I didn't play it very much because I was not a fan. Really? The yeah, it was, it was, it was, well, no, Mega Man 64. It was so wonky. 64. 64 had slightly better controls, but it was still like... On PlayStation, you had to use the like shoulder buttons to actually turn your character. And was, I don't know. I think 64, you actually got to use your C buttons, if I remember. <laughs> I played it's one of those the, things, too, where you had to... Where it was, you know, some of the first times these guys have been had tried to make a 3D version of the game. Yeah, that's true. And, uh, and everybody they was doing still, that. And they still... Ocarina everyone, of Time came out before that game, and they that game would have actually worked wonderfully with that's what Ocarina I was gonna say. of Time controls. The people, the the people and all that. who did Mario 64 mm -hmm. and the people who did uh, Zelda, uh, Ocarina, and, uh, and Majora's, like, those were 3D formulas that worked out really well. They are. Yep. But then there's other ones I don't think worked as well. Like, I, Sonic to me doesn't work very well as a 3D game. Um, Blasphemy. And <laughs> and uh, same with uh, like Mega Man. Like, they're the uh, they're types of games that I think Woo. the the format of the side scroller platformer is the the epitome of what the format should be for that game. I'm with you on that. Like, Sonic just doesn't work 3D. No, it's weird, especially when you have to run fast and then you don't know what's coming around a corner or some mm -hmm. shit. Yeah. Whoops. When they're Whoops. when you're doing the <laughs> what's happening? When you're doing the ah! the <laughs> levels where you go through the portal and you get all the balls and shit. Oh yeah, those. That's yep. all kind of quote unquote 3D ish. Yep. Um, but yeah, there's some. I mean, Ouch. Metroid did good jobs with 3D as well. Yeah, they, Prime is like probably my favorite Metroid. One of them, my favorite. I do right. love um, Metroid, Super Metroid. Metroid but I love lends the itself Primes. well to that. Metroid yeah. you know Prime I mean? was great. Metroid, yeah, it, it translated perfectly to 3D. It yeah. was like the most grim and like lonely game. Mm -hmm. yeah. Like you're just by yourself. And like there's no NPCs to talk to. You just had to scan stuff and like just. Yeah. Be, at, be by yourself. You couldn't like go up to like a villager and be like, hey, what's going on? It's it's a it's a format. Oh, we're purple. They're formats that I, actually strange. lend itself to the game and are actually allow the game series to be better. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Where I don't think Sonic that worked for because it's inherently just kind of slower because you have to so much more like obstacles. Yeah, and we'll leave it at that. We'll be weirdness. back in the next one. More Ooh. hot takes. <laughs> yeah, more hot takes on uh, Metroid and Mega Man and the comparisons. Thanks.